Right now, the biggest impact from the storm is happening in Franklin County. At least one road is now shut down due to the storm. ABC 27's Jada Williams is live there now. Jada, what are conditions like? Brian, uh, Angela, it is very windy out here and the rain is starting to fall. Uh, sometimes the rain is a little more heavier as of right now. It's more of a misting in the air right now. I'm here at one of the piers in Carabelle and driving to Carabelle. There is some debris on the road already. We also came across one flooded road that's due to storm surge. As we mentioned before, that was on Alligator Road just off of Highway 98. Flooding and strong winds have been top of mind for emergency workers here in the county. On Friday, people were asked to evacuate campgrounds and RV parks. You're also being asked to stay off of those roads and bridges in the county that are known to flood. We're going to have um, high surf, which we have double uh, red flagged our beaches. They're closed because we don't want people in the water for the very fact that we don't want to respond to uh, losing their life or someone else. The emergency management team is on standby and there are deputies patrolling the entire county as the Franklin County awaits for Nestor to make landfall.